Today I get to do something slightly differently, courtesy of Phil Henrik at Teva, uh, not Teva Motors anymore, important to remember that, Teva just on their own. They are a British OEM scaling up with this beauty behind an urban delivery truck. Seven and a half tons initially, moving to 12 and 19 in the future. Um, and they're also making sure that you've got one, an urban delivery, but also for those longer journeys, they're moving to hydrogen fuel cell technologies. Now this vehicle is made up of three batteries. So these are the three batteries. You've got the 40 there, another 40 here, and a 30 just in there, giving 110 kilowatts and around 200 kilometers of range, which is perfect for the urban environment. Now, I mentioned hydrogen fuel cell. So we're gonna take that out, 30 kilowatts out, leaves you with 80 kilowatts, and put kilowatt hours, of course, that's how we measure battery sizes, always complicated. Anyway, we're gonna put a hydrogen fuel cell in there, so the hydrogen tanks will go there, and then 450 kilometers range makes a big big difference but because they've got a lot of batteries they only have to have a small amount of hydrogen 15 kilos or thereabouts so it makes it a real proposition for the market to increase that range it's fitted with 120 kilowatt motors giving around 160 brake horsepower output and of course being an electric truck that means never being in the wrong gear at the wrong time Having been out for a drive in this, it's so smooth, the acceleration is brilliant, and I've been in trucks, crunching the gears, being in the wrong place at the wrong time. This allows you to get into gaps and make the best of your delivery day. Perfect for the inner city operation with 2.9, 2.86 uh, tons payload, which is great in and around the towns and cities that this vehicle will be operating both here in the UK but also around Europe. Of course, Paris going zero emission is gonna mean a big deal for Teva. So, they're scaling up, they're building their brand, and from what I've seen, doing it really, really well. They're just there is a bunch of pre-production vehicles that are gonna be going out to test with customers both here in the UK and across Europe. This vehicle behind me, a test vehicle that is they're getting lots and lots of data but it's important to know that Teva Motors have been Teva sorry um, have been around for around eight years I've got hundreds of thousands of miles of operating data with big big customers using range extenders um, and these all of these things are now beginning to play into this big finished product and it is quality let me tell you I can see this making a big impact in the inner cities of our country but also across Europe. Forgive all the background noise, this is a working environment. These vehicles are going on the road, it's great news. And the crazy thing is, yeah, I've got to wear clown shoes. Ah! But it's all worth it to see this product in the flesh and to know that the future is in safe hands with this product. Very, very happy to have been here today and seen it. All the credentials are right. September for the first deliveries of this vehicle on the road. Fantastic hydrogen fuel cell six months after, 12 ton, few months after that, 19 ton, few months after that. A roadmap, one that we can rely on, yes. So that's it from the Teva truck. I will be back to drive it, to take it out on the road. Yeah, I'm old fart, grandfather right, seven and a half ton. Happy days. Um, but thanks to the team here at Teva for letting me see this vehicle and being inspired, full of hope for the future of the electric Teva truck.